So Amazon has been pushing a bunch of new updates for the Fire TV Stick, and a few weeks back, they decided to introduce a bunch of new commands for Alexa so you can control your Fire TV Stick in new ways. Like controlling Netflix on your Fire TV Stick from your Echo Dot, skipping YouTube videos or adding stuff to your shopping list directly from your TV, and much more. If you haven't already checked out that one, click on the YouTube cards to watch that after this one. And today Amazon announced that it'll bring the Alexa routines to the Fire TV devices, which basically means that you can bundle a bunch of Alexa commands together and then execute them all at once. Let me show you how. So say I'm watching the boys on my Fire TV stick and want to get some popcorn, so I'll say Alexa, break time. Then Alexa will acknowledge my command and then it'll pause the Fire TV stick and turn on the smart lights at the same time. Similarly, when I come back, I've created a routine where Alexa, movie time, Welcome back, master. and it'll turn off the smart lights and resume the show. It's almost like I'm in a movie theater. Now that's just one example of the routines that you can execute on the Fire TV devices and the possibilities are just endless. Like say if you're watching a movie on your TV and suddenly you hear the doorbell, you can program a routine where it'll automatically turn off the lights and then show you the security footage from the front door. That way you don't have to, you know, go to the doorbell and see who it is and all that stuff. The possibilities are just endless, like I told you before. So how do you create these routines for Fire TV Stake, you ask? Well, I'm Vandy from Smart Dance Proxy and if you're new to this channel, click on that subscribe button. That way you get notified every time we put out a new video on either streaming devices, tips and tricks or little hacks like this that are quite useful to regular people or tech enthusiasts as well. With that out of the way, let's see how you can create personalized and customized routines that you can use with the Alexa TV and all of your smart gadgets. First, you need to download the Alexa app from the App Store, then open it and then connect all of your smart home devices like your Echo Dot, Fire TV Stick and Smart Lights to your Alexa account. Make sure all of your smart gadgets are under the same Alexa account and the same Wi-Fi for this to actually work. For info on how to connect them, check out our other videos that we have done before. Anyway, once you have everything set up, tap on the more option from the bottom navigation controls. And then select routines from the menu. Now here you can create your own routines. I've created a few of them myself, which I'll delete and then show you from scratch. So to build your own routine, go to the routine section and tap on the plus button on the top right corner. From here, you need to specify three things, name, the trigger command, and the series of actions. So for name, let's say break time and tap on next. And when this happens, I wanna get this activated when I say a voice command to my Echo Dot placed next to my TV. So I'll select voice option and the command could be like anything, but let's just go with break time and then save the changes. Under actions, the first thing I wanna do is turn on the smart lights in the TV room. So tap on the plus sign and go to smart home. There, you'll find your smart lights that you've connected with your Alexa app. Select the one that you want and tap on next. Here, you have the option to turn it on or off or change the brightness or even change color as well. I like to keep things simple, so I'm just going to keep it power on and the smart light. And then I'll save the changes. Next, Alexa should respond with some message so that I know it got my command. So again, tap on the plus icon and select Alexa says and set a customized message on whatever you want brownie points if you think of something quirky because that way everyone gets to hear your wittiness. And the final thing I want Alexa to do is to pause the playback on my Fire TV stick. So again, tap on the plus sign, select the TV. If, if you have multiple Fire TV sticks, choose the one that you want to pause in the setup. Like in my case, it's Smart Dance Proxy Fire TV stick and then under action, you can either pause, resume or navigate to home screen, etc. and choose the ones that you want. But for this instance, I want to pause the playback so tap on next and then save the changes. Now the final setup is to save this routine. To do so, tap on the save option on the top right corner and you'll notice that it'll ask where do you want to execute this command. And in my case, I want to do it with the Echo Dot 4 that I have next to my TV. So I'll choose a smart DNS proxy Echo Dot from the list. And that's it. Go back and then save the changes. Now let's put it to test and see if it actually works. Tap on the play button next to the break time and then there you go. Now, let's do the reverse routine of that to see if it does the opposite of it, which we would want, like Uno reverse card. So the steps are pretty much the same, and then tap on the plus sign on the top right, give the name of your routine. Remember, name of the routine has nothing to do with the routine invoke command, and both could be different from each other. So once you give it a name like movie time, I want the Alexa command to be Alexa, movie time, and then save changes. 
Now for actions, I want to reverse everything that I did in the previous routine, so I'll start by turning off the light, and then make Alexa say welcome back, and then finally resume Fire TV Sticks playback. Save changes, and then again, I want all of these commands to be done on SmartDNS Proxy's Echo Dot placed next to my TV. So I'll do that, and then save changes, and then I'll go back. Let's put it to test and see if it actually works, like before with the other command. Tap on the play button next to movie time, and then boom. Welcome back, master. So there you go, that's how you set up routines on your Fire TV set. I use the movie time and break time quite a lot, but that's just me, you know. You can set up whatever you want. So let me know which ones you are going to set up and which ones you like in the comments section below. While you're at it, check out smartdnsproxy.com if you're keen to unblock geo-restricted content on your Fire TV stick or other devices that you have, be it Apple TV, you know, HBO Max, streaming services like Netflix, Hulu, Pandora, Amazon Prime, there's a bunch of those. You can unlock all of them for about five bucks a month, which is bugger all. And there's even a 14 day free trial so you can test the waters and then see how you like it. As always, I'm Vamsi, thanks for watching, and if you're new here, subscribe, because it really does help out. And I'll see you in the next one, because I've been saying that for a long time, and I've been seeing you every time, so I keep my promises. See ya.